Here I'm showing you some uh, of our finished uh, lost circulation material. That over there, by the way, is uh, bales of hemp we bought from a, a farmer in Colorado, which indicates, unfortunately, um, if you do grow uh, fiber hemp, we're the only place in town that you can actually sell it to. And hopefully there'll be 20 of these kinds of facilities as we, not just ours, but uh, other people as well, so we can create a beautiful hemp infrastructure. Now, here's the LCMs in this room. I can never get to all, to all the rooms in one video because it's too far apart. There's some, you know, in another room. Probably got about twice as much as you just saw in this video in other rooms in the warehouse. But this, the blue wrapping is uh, 50 pound bags and the super sacks are a little over a thousand pounds, um, like 1100, uh, 1150. So this is our inventory since I've been gone in the last three months. All right, this is the inventory from the other side of the, this big giant stack here that in the, on, from the video above. Here's another room with more inventory. And I think maybe I'll go and get the, um, the other room so you can have three videos that'll show what we have in inventory. It may take four videos. You can see we have quite a lot of lost circulation material in inventory uh, to fill the demand. The demand for LCMs is not a pallet load here, pallet load there. The oil companies ordered this by the truckload. And some companies like Pemex as an example, the Mexican oil company, they spend $40 million a month buying lost circulation material. They are one of our target customers. Whether we get them or not, we'll see, but we have plenty of other oil companies that size and bigger and smaller that we'll be marketing their LCMs too.